Well, we are in the middle of the migratory season for the monarch butterfly. However, their numbers are critically low this year. Fox 11's Brayton Metzger takes us to the Monarch Grove in Pismo Beach, where only a fraction of the butterfly population has returned. The monarch butterfly is a beautiful reminder of the delicate balancing act of nature. With their numbers at alarmingly low levels, Congressman Salud Carbajal, along with Congressman Jimmy Panetta of California's 20th District, and Senator Jeff Merkley of Oregon wrote to the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service to express their concern about the decision to forego listing the butterfly under the Endangered Species Act. So if we can identify, respond, and take care of a situation that can be taken care of with human intervention, I think it's going to be a great effort. Each winter, tens of thousands of butterflies migrate south starting in November to avoid the colder weather but this year is different. Usually they're in one big cluster in one or two trees that turns the entire tree bright orange because there are so many butterflies. It's really beautiful to see. Only a few hundred monarch butterflies have been spotted at the Pismo Monarch Grove this year. There's little schematics around the park just to talk about the life cycle of the butterfly and uh, it's just sad when people can't actually observe them in person. According to scientists, butterfly populations are at critical levels due to climate change, destruction of milkweed habitats along their migratory routes, and the increased use of pesticides. I think you have to keep an open mind and you have to realize that we are all connected, whether we're feather, whether we're uh, fur, or we're skin. And uh, what affects one affects us all. If nothing is done, the monarch butterfly could become the 48th species to go extinct while waiting to join the endangered list. In Pismo Beach, Brayton Metzger, Fox 11 News.